everybody, welcome to the Messy Church Light Party. My name is Wendy and I'll talk you through the UV treasure hunt activity today. It's the perfect time of year to have a light party, isn't it? And have some fun with light. And I think it's really good to see just how well the light can chase the darkness away. But I also love treasure hunts and I used to do them with my children on their birthday to oh, just make, have some fun to make them find their presents. So I think this will be even more fun to do with the clues to use with, well, what looks like invisible ink and a light pen. So what do we need? We need some white paper and we need the UV light pen. And you might also want to think about a prize at the end. Um, it could be some sweets or even as simple as giving the winner a hug. But if you don't have a UV light pen, there is another option as well. Um, you can do this with some lemon juice um, using something like a cotton bud or maybe even a paintbrush I guess um, to use the lemon juice to dip it in and write on the piece of paper and once it dries you can use a torch to see that in the dark. So a couple of options there. Well how does it work to set up your treasure hunt? I think you probably already have a good idea but uh, what I'd suggest is that it's you write up to six clues on different bits of paper so using your pen being able to write on the paper, which of course you can't see at the moment until you put it until you put it under the UV. Um, it's a good idea to keep your clues easy enough for others to understand as well, um, so that they can work them out quite easily. And I've got a few examples here of of rhyming um, rhyming clues because that can be a bit fun too. And then I'll just show you one clue I've written earlier and put in the box to be able to see it in the dark. So I'll just grab the um, camera. Okay, and here's some examples of some rhyming clues. You can make up your own, but they're just a few ideas that you could use. And then in the box here, I can show you one I prepared earlier, and you can start to see the words come up in the dark. Well, that's it. And I'll put these back up. Have some fun.